Testing, testing, one, two, three. My name is LA, pronounced like LA, like the city. I'm not from there, but I'm breezy. Welcome to another glorious and epic event of Count Your Blessings. It is um, Wednesday, March 10th. Wednesday, March 10th, 2021. And as you can see in these videos, I'm showing you different sides of me, per se, even when it comes to different looks in my hair. I've been out of the scene showing my face for quite a while. Let me try something. I like that. I've been out of the scenes for quite a while far as showing my, my, my stage presence per se. I did a lot of voiceovers and those were fun and it got me through. Oh, so that's another thing I probably can be thankful for. So once again, my name is LA, pronounced like LA, like the city. I'm not from there, but I'm breezy. And today is March 10th, Wednesday, 2021. And welcome to Count Your Blessings. I hope you have been counting your blessings and participating with me in this challenge. It is a month long challenge for however many days there are in this month. I probably picked the longest month to do this challenge. <sighs> Story of my life. But we are in the 10th day and I'm going with strong. So, I mean, hey, can't turn back now. I encourage you to do it because it's a, it, it creates a great mental thing in your head and in your spirit. So you can just continue on being humble and thankful for your little blessings and not forgetting them. I like this challenge because it's showing me not to forget the little things, even though I say it all the time. It's an exercise to train my brain not to forget. Today, I want to talk about coffee. It's spelled C-O-F-F-E-E, -E, right? Cough. Fee-fee. <laughs> and I wanted to do this video, too, because I did my hair yesterday. I might have to make a separate video. But I did my hair yesterday. Like, I washed it. I added the color in it. And I conditioned it. And I just wanted to just show off the colors in my hair before I um, straighten it all back out. It feels so comfortable. It's so fluffy. The conditioner I use. And I believe the um, hair color that I put in here to redo my hair has got built-in conditioner too. So I just, I'm just happy for my hair. So I'm just showing it off in the colors. It's so pretty. Look at it. I'm thankful for my hair. Maybe that'll be in my next video. Look at my hair shake. It's all mine. I'm so happy. It's so pretty. And it's colorful like a rainbow. Now moving on. We're talking about coffee and how wonderful it is. I never really appreciated the joys of coffee to this extent that I enjoy it now since having met my husband. Because I didn't realize how something so simplistic as coffee and or tea or any hot beverage. Including hot beer. Whatever floats your boat. But anything like that, I'm going to just stick with coffee. Share it with someone. It's fun. It's crazy how something as simple as coffee and, and, and chatting with someone is so cool. I mean, when I was by myself, I enjoyed having a coffee maker because I liked how the smell of coffee filled the kitchen. And the particular coffee that I did have at that time in my life before meeting my husband... It made the kitchen smell like McDonald's, and I loved how the way a McDonald's smelled in the morning. During the breakfast time, you smelled the strong coffee. That's all you could smell, and, and fried grease, potatoes, potato grease, and strong coffee. Oh my gosh, I just I could just be at McDonald's in the morning just ordering a coffee, getting a newspaper like those old people do. And just sitting there until they switched over to lunch. And then I'm out. I'm all the 3,000. Um, or however you say it. And I'm not even a senior citizen yet. But I can dig it. So coffee is it's wonderful. And it's so cheap. I'm so thankful that it's so inexpensive. Thank you, God. Because if you have anything else in your pantry, adults, you have to have microwave popcorn. That's inexpensive. Sugar. And you gotta have coffee. And at the bare minimum, because I don't do creamers. Ugh, and, and I just don't. I stick with coffee straight up or sugar. That's it. So you gotta have, you gotta have popcorn. 
at all times, coffee at all times, sugar at all times. It just get you through. Coffee, it's just... <laughs> it's like the whole ceremony. <laughs> and the preparation of coffee itself is a treat. It's a joy. It's like, you gotta take the pot, do, 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 shake it around, swish it out, pour it down the drain, hold it on to the light, make sure it ain't stained. <laughs> If it's clean, pour the purified water into the pot, then pour it down in the thing. Yield six cups. Three cups for me. Three cups for he. Three cups for me. Three cups for he. <laughs> I got it down to a science. So. We do six cups, three for him, three for me. Six cups, three for me, three for him. Six cups fill the purified water at the line. Don't get the water from the faucet unless you have rich people water. That's another story. Purified water and or boiled water. Pour it down in the thing. Line six. I put two and a half hefty hefty on the two tablespoons light on the half in the filter paper drop it on down and spread it out drop down get your ink on get your ego on copy close the thing push start and walk away now as I'm walking away well well in preparation for this religion of coffee I'm gonna select my mugs at this moment, since we started over our coffee, uh, our coffee mug collection, we are back down to square one, where we have three, three different coffee sets, not individual mugs, three different coffee sets to choose from. A set from my husband, well, shoot, two sets my husband picked out, and one set our son picked out. So that leaves me. Now I'm taking a long time to pick out which coffee set I want to get. Because, I mean, it's your signature mug. You know, you have a signature individual mug. And then you have the family-oriented or coffee set that you use. So I'm trying to find something. I'm actually searching on Mercari. I'm searching, I'm actually searching on Makai. Boom, 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 boom. Searching on Makai. Boom, 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 boom. Hey, yeah. Yeah, when Gross take that, I, I got the, I got the hits. I got the hits. Ah, I got the hits. Ah, I got the hits. Shamo. <laughs> so I'm actually searching on Makai, taking my time, looking for the perfect, um, mug set that I can contribute to our mug collection. All right, mug collection. I tell you, it's just so many good things and joys that revolve around the joys of coffee. I'm married. Just have to throw that in there, FYI. I love saying that. <sighs> to a wonderful man. Praise God. And we drink coffee every morning, and I just, I'm just so grateful because it just really heightened everything. I get so excited to prepare the coffee. Sometimes when he has to get up for work, he, he wake up earlier before the alarm clock is set. Because I'm supposed to be the one who will wake up and make the coffee for him. You know, he's not supposed to do anything until it's time for him to actually start getting ready for work. I make the coffee and I make the breakfast. I make sure his outfit is ready. So sometimes when he get up before me... He be in there trying to make the coffee, so I hear him. I'm like, hey! <laughs> I'm trying to stumble, stumble around out the bed, trying to find my slippers, <laughs> get myself together. Like, hey, got me! <laughs> I'm making the coffee. Go sit your phone right now. You ain't supposed to be working before work. <laughs> he was like, I just wanted you to sleep. Sleep? I sleep when I'm dead. <laughs> Let me make the coffee. <laughs> you know, but in another part of my mind, I'm like, what are you trying to say? I can't make the coffee right? 
Well, I'm in my 10 minute max. I'm ready to wrap this up because I gotta go make dinner. It's me, LA pronounced like LA, like the city I'm not from there, but I'm breezy. Ciao. Oh.